Hey guys, so today I'm going to be talking about Crew AI and what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be researching real estate, prop, real estate investment suburbs in Bangalore and what we're going to be getting from this is low and max prices as well as the potential rental yields from these suburbs. So what we're going to be using is Crew AI, Langchain Community, Chat Open AI and Serpa which is a web tool that browses Google search history. So Crew AI is a bunch of is a framework for uh, Python framework, in which you can perform give tasks and roles and more context to your agents. So it's very easy to create a Crew uh, AI agent and then give it a task, and then you'll have an entire crew where you have multiple agents and multiple tasks, with each task being assigned to different agents, and also the ability ability for agents to delegate their tasks between each other. So here we can see first, we have our first agent, the researcher agent. So we have all these fields that we fill in. LLM is equal to our LLM, the role, the goal, the backstory. Then the allow delegation right now we have is equal to false. Tools is equal to search tools. In this case, you're looking for retail properties to invest in. Verbose is equal to true. And its first task is description. Search the internet for Bangalore related properties, a detailed report in this format, agent researcher. So the agent assigned, this task got assigned to this agent. So beauty, this task got an agent. That's what happened here. Similarly, we have a writer agent and a writer task. This summarizes everything. So once we have everything ready, we can kick our crew off. So all we have to do is say crew is equal to true. Our agents and our tasks specify and verbose is equal to two. You can control this. Then you just do task output is equal to crew dot kick off. So we kick off this function or this object. And then we print our task output. So let's just go to our command terminal and do CD Quickly, let me find this. We're in downloads. Yep, we're inside Korea property bot. And now we will Python run flow.py. Here we go. So it had its first thought. Before I can identify promising retail properties for investments in Bangalore, India, I need to gather data on various suburbs, including their mean, low and average prices. Action, search the internet. So every time it's going to have a thought and do an action and the action will have an action input. So the action here was search the internet. So it gave a search query, promising real estate investment suburbs in Bangalore 2023. But here, as you can see, this data is not going to have very critical data like mean, low or max prices or very specific data like rental yields. So this search would have to get very strong. So as you can see, after every thought and action, it's going to start bettering its real estate like ideas. So here I think it got an idea that Indranagar is one of the better areas. So it's looking specifically for Indranagar here. So it's a researcher, right? So it's going to collect data. So I don't know why it's doing Indranagar again and again, but okay, here we go. We have it. Indra Nagar, we have mean price 12,500 square feet, lowest price 3 lakhs for an entry level properties, max price 3.96 crore for high properties, rental vacancy information not really available, rental yield 5%, notable features, cosmopolitan culture with wealthy neighborhoods, diverse residential options including apartments and luxury homes, finished chain.
so is equal to task output is saved the low price is saved suburb and here yeah we have the finished chain and here's the finished output so what we can see now is we have the task output saved here and we have the task two output saved here so this is very useful now you can go ahead and configure the roles and the examples you give to direct this in a better way for your personal use case also remember never to display your api keys like i have done here i will immediately be deleting this api keys after this video anyways catch you in the next one hope this was helpful